Okay, here's how I set up a gaming mouse um, to work with Blender. Uh, just one application that I've set up so far. Uh, these side buttons that you can see the light kind of fades on and off, but you don't really notice it when you're using it with your fingers. What I've done is I've mapped uh, starting here at the bottom uh, front camera and then uh, used a web design acronym uh, for CSS, top, right, bottom, left, or trouble. So I remember what the buttons are. So it goes camera, top, right, bottom, left. And then here goes front and then back. And then from back, it jumps over one to where I can switch between perspective and ortho. So if I'm sitting here um, working on something, I can go, uh, here's camera, top, right, bottom, left, front, back and then switch between ortho and perspective like that. So, uh, so far versus the Space Navigator, this is a pretty awesome setup <laughs> for, for just for what I do anyway, because uh, I'm always switching between views and I haven't even added modifier keys yet and I've still got this back row of buttons plus this one um, in addition to these other wacky buttons here that came on this gaming mouse. So kind of, a, I'm glad I purchased this. It was like a third of the price of the Space Navigator and it's a pretty good little setup uh, for 3D modeling.